The Blackstone Merchants Association held its second town hall meeting today with Fresno City leaders, and those leaders heard plenty about the homelessness and crime that businesses continue to face along Blackstone. Fox 26 News reporter Myra Franco attended that meeting and fills us in now on what was said. Myra? Liz Monty, this was the second time small business owners were able to speak with city leaders in this format. I mean, many say they have seen progress, but they feel so much more still could be done. For years, homelessness and crime have plagued many small business owners along Blackstone Avenue in central Fresno. It's a story Fox 26 News has been following for years. We founded Blackstone Merchants Association in 2016 and uh, been rolling since. <laughs> AJ Rasami is the president of Blackstone Merchants Association and a business owner. He says things are getting a little bit better, but there is still more work to do. And he credits town hall meetings like this one. So last year we had another town hall meeting, the first one, this is the second one. And after that meeting, then I met with the mayor, the council member, we had a lot of changes and we had a lot of improvement. Starting with an exchange of ideas. I learned something and I hope that you learned something as well as far as, far as what's available out there for your businesses, either through resources or, or what can the police do about it. And experiences, many approach city representatives to share their hopes. Yeah, I'm asking. They listened. Thank you. I know you guys can't do everything, but we need to make this place like it looked like River Park. Nobody wants to shop down here. Businesses are hurting. Businesses are suffering. We're trying to stay low low, but look at where we're at. Yes, we can get the homeless out, but let's make the place look nice. Let's make it look better. I'll be the head of community. I don't care. Let's get it together. Let's all volunteer. Um, I see my boss. Thank you. Thank you. Others expressing gratitude and sharing how cleanup operations, resources for those experiencing homelessness, and facade improvement grants have helped them. We have dealt with a lot in the past, but now we honestly appreciate you guys a lot. You guys have done a lot. We've had a lot of catalytic converters in the past and so on. But recently, with the security that you guys have been hiring, the police officers that you guys are going to be hiring, I see this number shrinking. Chief Paco Badarama mentioned in that meeting that tackling this problem is complicated, but they also have to be sensitive and compassionate towards the homeless as well. He also points out that the city has reduced homelessness by about five to six percent compared to other cities here in California. Live in Central Fresno, I'm Myra Franco, Fox 26 News. All right, thank you, Myra. And there is a $1 million grant available for qualifying businesses in districts one and four for facade improvements. That's under the city of Fresno general fund. This is also funded in part by the Fresno area Hispanic foundation along with the city applicants have until uh, later this month to apply. And with that for today's question of the day, we want to know, do you feel the city has worked to make changes to the homelessness problem on Blackstone? You can chime in with your answer on KMPH.com. All you have to do is click on the story and a poll will be provided. Want to see more stories like this? Watch Great Day weekday mornings from 5 to 10 and Fox 26 News at 10.